I have like a little acronym called FAST and that, I, that I often employ for myself um, and, and encourage my clients to as well. And it really is feel, acknowledge, accept, um, speak, and time. And so very often we use this tool when dealing with emotional eating. So the urge to um, eat food to change the channel in our head or to change what we're feeling in our head. So, you know, feel is relatively simple. It's like actually just trying to get into where in my body do I physically feel this taking place? Um, acknowledge or accept is, is really coming to that place that, hey, I didn't choose this emotion. It's, it's okay that it's here. There's not something wrong with me because I'm experiencing a difficult emotion. And speak isn't necessarily speak out loud. It could be writing on paper, but it's producing language to try and define what it is that we're feeling. Like what's going on in my body right now? And then T is time. And so for, for majority of cases, the most intense part of an emotion, the most intense part of a, an emotional wave, to put it that way, lasts only about seven to 10 minutes. Like, yes, the residual of that emotion might, might stick around for a few hours, but the most intense part of any sort of urges and emotions will last only seven to 10 minutes. And so if we can create a little bit of time between ourselves and maybe an impulsive or negative action um, driven by that emotion, we're much more likely to make better choices.